Hey, Emma. How are you? How's Jeremy? I spoke to his mom today. Emma, are you okay? <sighs> He's still unconscious. She said not to come. That it was family only. Oh, you are family, family though. She didn't know we were engaged. She had no idea. Emma, I'm so sorry. No. You were right. I got another email today. It said you shouldn't disturb the dead. I also got mail today. Oh my god, Emma, no! No. Why would you have that? Get rid of that shit, Emma! Emma, you know what they say about dolls and spirits. Emma! I'll eat your soul! No! Shut up! What the fuck? We didn't say anything. There's got to be something to explain this. I found something. An article online states that all the victims' internet history was searched and all eight of the deceased had visited the same website. Police haven't made a statement about whether this has any connections with the suicides, but they believe it's a lead. What's the website? Uh, Theocal.com? That's the website! Are you kidding me? What, you, you guys know the site? Holy shit! The poem! What poem? That I read to you. It was about this woman and it was, it was really weird. What, what was the name? Deidre Moore. No, if it has anything to do Deirdre with- Deidre Moore was a widowed whore who thrived on children's bones. She would sleep all day and refuse to pray since her beloved was taken away. The seasons would change, but Deirdre would stay just as ugly and old as before. Until one day when a charming young man knocked on her door. Stop, please. Stop. This is ridiculous. You both went to a website and, and read a poem. Now you're being haunted? The internet doesn't work like that. There was a video, too. Oh, wow, a video, too. This isn't the ring. It's true. You don't know who you're talking to or what you're reading. What if we went onto a site or... Or clicked on something that we weren't supposed to find. You guys, this is seriously beyond crazy. What if it's real? What if we are the next victims? What if... <laughs> I am floating. Floating out to sea. Yeah, contrary to popularly, I ain't invincible, not even close. I'm just a little girl, a failure to most. I'm a flower.